So in Vertical Horizon, I generally write the songs on acoustic guitar. So there's an acoustic guitar element at the core of every song for this band. And to not have the ability to bring some acoustic sounds into that song in a live setting would be almost disingenuous to the song. first person I ever saw use the piezo in combination with the electric was Alex Lifeson. And it blew my mind because of course Rush famously had, had three guys on stage that sounded like 20. But in particular Alex had all these beautiful acoustic tones coming out of this PRS. It was a bolt-on git guitar if I remember correctly. Most of the guitars that I had been aware of up to that point that were sort of dual function guitars were almost, they almost seemed to be designed by acoustic players who wanted to have some electric tones. And the PRS stuff to me was electric guitars designed by electric players that also had the ability to make acoustic sounds. And to me, that's the real sweet spot. You know, I don't like having a wound G. I don't want for my acoustic guitar to pretend that it's an electric guitar. I love for my electric guitar to have the capability of giving me acoustic sounds. One of the greatest things about this guitar in particular is it's light. It's, it sounds kind of almost silly to talk about the weight of a guitar. It's not a little thing, actually. You know, this thing is as light as a feather on your body, and as a result, at the end of the set, you have more energy. You haven't been expending energy trying to lug that, you know, weight around. It just makes me more f free on stage. It's great to have the sort of individual notes be able to speak through in the way that an acoustic guitar can. For me, that's really where the magic happens with a system like this. Everything works on this guitar. It's great sounding when you're just playing it electric, it's great sounding when you're just playing it acoustic, and then you can do all the blending in between. It's like, there's, nobody loses <laughs> with this thing. I, you know, I've, I've oftentimes thought about the hollow body too as a sort of Swiss army knife of guitars. As someone who has played live for many, many years, I love the idea of adding more to the performance experience, both for the audience and for the performer. And I just love the idea that I'm not limited to just being an electric guitar player or just being an acoustic guitar player. It's just so flexible, it's so expressive. I love this thing.